I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. I'm lamping. Uh huh. Okay, what were you saying about uh, Ninja Guy All right. Sigma? Okay, so you were saying, um, uh, you were talking about the notes and how in the Xbox version oh, it's God. better that it saves the notes, but you were also saying earlier that. Ah, shit. Just give me this fucking okay. talk. You were also saying. John's playing! Okay. You were also saying earlier that. It's John's turn. In one of the earlier episodes of Game Grumps, that. Uh, when you die and you lose all the notes, it's it's an incentive to not die. Yeah, it's, it is. Which I agree with. Um, but so like, there's a balance that you can strike. So in Mega Man X, when you fight the last boss Sigma, you kind of need like all four sub tanks to beat him if you're just kind of like a casual Mega Man X player, right? Um, um, if you die and you use up all your sub tanks, they're still empty. But right before Sigma, there's like these caterpillars that spawn infinitely that aren't in the game at all, other than that point, and they always drop items. So you can like sit there and kind of farm life. It doesn't really take that long, but it's still obnoxious enough to be an incentive to not fucking die against Sigma again. So like, if it respawned you with just full sub tanks, it's like, oh, I died. Whatever, I can just fucking fight Sigma again. No big yeah. deal. But since there's kind of like a punishment for it, where you're like, oh shit, now I gotta get fucking my sub tanks filled again. It's not that obnoxious, but it's obnoxious enough to be like, feel like a legit punishment. Let's <laughs> see how fucking. How fucking proficient I am at that. Oh, yeah, and then you fall. Fuck you, I, I didn't for most of it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see how good I am? <laughs> Do you see how good I got eaten by the piranha? Fuck you, bro! I'm delicious! Uh, can I ask you something? Okay. Fuck off and get out. No. I ate shit. Do you agree, though? Um, like, how do you feel about the the notes because of that? What do you mean? Well, after saying that. Well, I did. Well, I don't die as much as you in this, so it didn't bother me as much. But if you were to die a lot, it would get annoying. Mm, yeah. Well, you know what? You know what's interesting about this game is that it's just fun. Yeah. So, so it like, doesn't really matter. Yeah. Either. So it's like, oh, I missed all the notes. Whatever. It's just when the notes are obnoxious, like when they're underwater or something. Yeah. I mean, like, I that's why Clanker's Cavern. Is kind of annoying like that because it's like it's just a this, is, this is bubble gloop, right? Yeah, this is bubble gloop. How come there's no fucking bubbles? Are you just okay? You, how, your name's and Aaron. how come gloop isn't in this? Your name's Aaron Hansen. Why aren't there any errands on you? Excuse me. You piece of shit. Excuse me. You gosh darn criticizer. Did you? Did you just say that I don't have any errands in me? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. Fucking asshole. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. I can't believe you. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> like the beginning of the universe was a robot. <laughs> it was Microsoft saying. <laughs> and he's like, I give birth to you. <laughs> Jesus. So does that mean we came full circle as a human race? Yes. By making Microsoft Sam? We were here to create in the image of our creator. Well, if we came full circle, then what's after it? Like a fucking spiral? Going full square. Duh. Cause you go from no sides. Yeah, I know, you go from in you side. go from infinite points to four. <laughs> Dude, that's where how it goes. For Vert some vertices! For some reason in my mind it goes like Never mind. Yeah, go on. Dude, I know a lot about maths. I know Look around about you. Maths. What is the biggest number? A Google. One million. A Google. Have you ever seen Look Around You? No. You haven't? No, maybe. Oh, it's fucking great. It's like a British comedy show. It's like, it's like, it's like, you know those like science shows you used to watch in elementary school with a yeah. really cheesy 90s, like, even more interestingly, if you add carbon <laughs> to water, like, I don't know, whatever, like those kinds of things. Yeah. It was like, I love how a lot of, oh, one thing I like about this game, actually, a lot of these people, like, that have the jiggies, it's almost like as if they found them, and they just are like, you're, you're taking my gold. <laughs> like they, they call it gold sometimes. It depends on, like, the, the like... Well, it is gold. Yeah, but I mean... What if there was some asshole that, like, already melted a jiggy into, like, a fucking watch, and it's like, <laughs> Do you have a, I heard you have a jiggy, and he's like, oh, sorry. He's like, oh, shit, that's important. Yeah, sorry, it's, I got, like, a goblet now. So, I mean, if you want the goblet, it's fine. <laughs> So like there's one world you just can't get into forever. You just you, you just put the goblet on the fucking <laughs> and it's like oh. you can't put this fucking new jigsaw puzzle, you stupid idiot. Like, Cause you're so stupid, man. 
Oh god! He sent it into cash for gold, and he's like, oh no, I have like two grand now. I, <laughs> I sent it into cash You for can just gold. go there and fucking try to get it back, but fucking I don't know. Cash. They spent good money on that. <laughs> fucking A. I don't remember this one. Did they call him Kazooie because he goes, yeah, Kazooie! I don't know. Apparently it's a Breagle, according to Shane. It's a Breagle? Oh, that's don't right. Don't you remember? That's right. Maybe it's a British Eagle. <laughs> Breagle? I don't know. Maybe it's a real thing. I gotta look it up now. Breagle? Breagle, yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hello. Hey, baby. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck. Where am I? Where am I? <laughs> what? This is good game design. <laughs> whoa. I mean, whoa. Oh, it's pretty good for Oh, look at this stuff. Look at that. Look at this awesome stuff. Oh, Get God. the boots. Hey, that's the guy from the intro. Gets the booty boots. Oh, you fucked up. Dude, you're getting eaten. Fuck you. Only guy got eat is you. Whoa. <laughs> we just went fucking from like regular fucking talk to just some malicious shit right there. I'm not tasty. Dude, let me show you the tip top. You remember, have you ever played uh, Diddy Kong Racing? It was like it Best Buy once. <laughs> Remember Tip Top by any chance? Do you remember? Hold on. Do you remember? Yeah, no. Okay, go on. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, I don't care. I got a story. I fucking cut you off all the time for fun. Okay. I end episodes by cutting you off. I, that's true. So I went to like the last one. What? You, yeah, like the last one. <laughs> um. So yeah, I played Diddy Kong Racing at Best Buy when they had when they just had like nine CRTs like hanging up in the sky. I remember that. Yeah. Did they have them at yours too? I guess it must have just been a corporate. Yeah, game. totally. So like, if you played Diddy Kong Racing, everyone could see you. Yeah, dude, I played Mario 64 like that, and it was like everyone can see. <laughs> and then you get like a fucking anxiety attack when you mess up. Like, <laughs> fuck, that is so annoying. Somebody's watching, and it's like, uh, 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 the guy didn't. Uh, and then he just like walks out of the store like with his, his head lowered. <laughs> like, can't believe he fell down. <laughs> Fell down, fucking idiot. I can't believe I trip. I learned a new move in Super Mario World, the other, Super Mario 64, the other day, and I can't believe that that fucking happened. What? What was it? ZB apparently does like a fucking, like it does like a, like a drop kick. You can kill piranha plants with it. Oh yeah. Fucking. Okay. Th th to be fair, that was something I didn't learn until later as well. Look at this is simple, fucking good game design. I also didn't learn ZA when he goes, woo, spin kick. Here's some fucking simple, elegant game design. Okay. That fucking nobody fucking thinks to do. Oh, I got this. Oh, shoot, now I have to wait out the period. No, I don't. I just push B. I love that. It's just little things like that. Like, there's a little, so many games will just have you wait out the fucking... It's true. A lot of games do that. It's pretty obnoxious. Dude, hurry up. You only have six. You get into a panic. Yeah, I kind of did. Sure, sure. Yeah, you do. I, I, didn't, I didn't even say anything. I was yeah. like, oh god. You were being so careful, and then it's like, oh, oh fuck. <laughs> Are you fucking? Can you get out of here? Maybe. Holy shit, you better fucking hurry. Oh. Dude, the piranhas. Uh oh. Oh, wow. Woo. Woo. Where are we? Oh, dear. Jumble Jet. Jetty? Jungle Jet. Jetty? Jungle, jungle Ninjetty? Jet. Ninjetty from Power Rangers? <gasps> I don't know what you're even saying! Why didn't you get the gold leaves? I don't have the move yet. Uh, did, you, did you know that in New Super Mario Brothers, if you lose enough, you get an in you get a, yeah. a golden tanuki suit? All of the games have that. Super Mario 3 Land has it. New Super Mario Brothers has it. Donkey Kong Country Returns has it. It's fucking annoying. A gold tanuki suit? So you're invincible and yeah. you can fly forever. Yeah, it's all all the new games have it. Oh! So if you're not good enough at a game, the game's like don't worry! Just fucking... whatever. We'll put you in god mode. Yeah, seriously. I, 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 it's so bad. Like, I mean, you know, I get why they do it, but it invalidates the game. And it's like, okay, you can't use the argument, just don't use it. Because it's like, it's part of the game. You, you're yeah. supposed to use everything at your disposal. Yeah. So, if you want to make an easy mode with it, fine. Don't put it in the normal game, otherwise it breaks the game. The yes. point. Yes, it's, it does. it's almost like it's just like I, I, it's such a like subtle thing. It's like it doesn't like ruin the game, but you're just kind of like, oh well, I could just fucking use that and win. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, exactly. 
No, 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 yeah, it's, it's, it, balance is really important in a game, because if there's no balance, then people just go for the dominant strategy, as it's yeah, called. Yeah, it's strategy. Because, like, if it was, if it was in, like, Super Mario World or something, it would just be like, I wouldn't, I would complain if it was in Super Mario World when I was a fucking kid. Yeah. Yeah, because if it's like, it's almost too hard, I'm just gonna die a couple times until I get the... Yeah. Old leaf. Oh, Super Mario Galaxy 2, I think, has it, too. Really? Yeah, it might not be as blatant, but it definitely has, like, a thing where it's like, do you want us to show you if you die too many times? I'm pretty sure. It's just, ugh, don't do that. Respect and yourself. In 3D man. Land, they do the... They do the... It's the block that gives you, like, an extra thing. When you start... Well, if you die, like, three times in a row, it just has, like, a random block that's like, oh, you got a mushroom. No, no, no. I swear, I could be wrong. I think 3D Land has the god mode thing. It has a better Tanuki suit at the end. It has the steel Tanuki suit. No, 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 there, there's a god mode in it. Really? If you die too many, I'm pretty sure there's a god mode. I haven't experienced it yet. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm wrong. All right, it anyways, might, be, it might only be in the special levels. This is such a cool mumbo. Yeah, you're kicking him. <laughs> you see this shit? Nom, 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 Crossfire! You get caught up in the crossfire! Next time on Game Grumps, crossfire! Ops, 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 